Welcome to our Disney Wish embarkation vlog. We are just now arriving at Port Canaveral. Disney Wish is right, literally right over there. There she is, brand spanking new. She is sparkly. This is Disney Cruise Line's newest ship. Just came out like three months ago. Our first time on it. We are very, very excited. If you're new here, please subscribe, turn on the bell notifications. It'll alert you the next time I post a new video. We're gonna be on the Disney Wish for three nights. There will be one vlog per day that we're on the ship. And there she is again. Literally, you can see her sparkle in the distance. I know, she's so shiny and new. First things first, we're gonna drop off our luggage with the porter, then we're gonna park our car. We've done our pre-cruise COVID testing, which is gonna go away in a couple weeks, so maybe by the time you're watching this, COVID testing is no longer a thing. Okay, one more, one more shot, one more shot. Just dropped off our luggage, that's our bags right there with him. And right here to the left is the parking. So after you drop off your bags, they give you a little yellow ticket to make sure that you're here at your port arrival time. You go here to your left, you pay for parking, and you park, and then you board the ship. We just came up to the top of the parking garage to get this awesome view of the ship. Pro tip, if you want a good photo of the ship, just come up to the very, very top of the parking garage. Oh, well, I already saw somebody on the Aquamouse. Once you're in the terminal, you come into your check-in and then you do security <laughs> and then up to the terminal. The time has come to board the Disney Wish, OMG. So I'm already getting that Disney Cruise smell. If you've been on a Disney Cruise before, you know that Disney Cruise smell the minute you smell it. Ready? Yeah. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh my God. Wow. So exciting. Hi. What's the family name? Well, we are Francesco and John. Francesco and John. Yes. Is that your first name? Is it? That's our first name. Yeah. Very Disney cool. Witch, please welcome my board. Francesco and John. Oh, oh look, the Halloween tree. It is so different. Oh my gosh. Look at Roy Disney. Oh look, so we got it's Rapunzel and Flynn Rider. They're up there. So we are heading to our stateroom now because our rooms are ready by now. We just want to drop off our bottles of bubbly. Uh-huh. Wow, this is so different and so amazing looking. So this is that Tiana's little bar that we've seen. I've seen so many YouTube videos on this ship. I feel like I know it already. Oh, and this is a hyperspace launch. It's open. You want to go really fast and look at it? Yeah. So, um... You can go in. Yeah, do it. So on embarkation day, hyperspace lounge has open house. So they're not serving drinks yet, but it is open for you to come and look at it. Nice, right? Yeah, it's better than the Skyline Lounge. Okay. Look at that, that's pretty cool. So every certain amount of time, I'm not sure how often, but that they go into hyper hyperspace. Into hyperspace, is that, is that a thing? I don't know. Okay, so rooms are not ready yet, so we are gonna go get a bite to eat. So here we have Mickey's Festival of Foods. They have like so many other options, like barbecue. Oh, this is the barbecue right here. I'll do some ribs and then some brisket and that's it. Okay, so we got some barbecue, not to find a place to sit. Okay, there's some spots to sit. Pizza, should we get pizza too? Oh my goodness. How about right here? This is my lunch, that's John's. Just right. kidding, so we actually doubled up and we're gonna share everything on there. This mac and cheese looks really good actually. He's gonna eat all that. I don't want that. <laughs> oh look, they have Donald's Cantina. I kind of want that as well. That's, we that's the Mexican food, or the tacos and stuff. Let's see if this is good or if it's like last time. Okay, go ahead, try it. Let's do a taste test. Oh wow, your eyes say, your eyes say it all. It's actually really good. Yeah? Let's try the sweet potato fries. Mmm, they're good too. So we're up in the pool deck. Funnel Vision's going on right now. They're playing Aladdin. Um, and we are about to get a cocktail here at the bar. Drink of the day, Captain's Mai Tai. How was lunch? It was good. We changed our mind on the drink. We're gonna hold off. We're gonna go to our stateroom first. They just opened up the staterooms. Everyone's trying to get to their room at the same time. Here's our room. 7654. Look at this. Is that ours? I would imagine it is, and someone did that. You ready? Francesco. Yeah. All right, here we go. <laughs> You gotta put your key in right here. Nice, look at this. Wow, this is very, very clean, very new. Oh, and we got, is this a frozen room? I think it's one of the frozen rooms. Or Cinderella. Cinderella. Oh, it is, sorry, sorry guys, I'm, I'm an idiot. It's a Cinderella room because there's the carriage. Although those look like reindeer, they don't look like horses. No, they look like horses. <laughs> look, <gasps> they gave us new lanyards. Castaway Club, they're black ones. They gave us a laundry bag. And then we got this bag, which is one of the new gifts that they're giving out for the inaugural sailing. So go ahead and open it up. Oh, it's stuffed in here. <laughs> I was like, yes. that was the bag, it's, I was like, that's ugly. No, it's what's inside. Oh. Nice. Oh. The next 10,000 subscriber gets a free bag. Eh. 
negative. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice. So yeah, this is a new thing that they're giving out for the inaugural sailings. And this laundry bag you also get, which is really nice. You could use it as a laundry bag if you want. Yeah. And then we have this thing. So I've seen all the gifts already in like previous videos. This is what happens when you watch pre-videos. I decided not to and to stop. I watch a lot so of I vlogs. I feel surprised. I watch a lot of vlogs before I came on this cruise. So I'm kind of already know what everything's going to be. So I ruined my, my own surprise. Um, so yeah, you get Disney Wish little castaway club. Kind of like a little wallet thing. You can store your stuff in there like money, passports, credit cards, whatever. Wow! Oh yeah, look, it is Cinderella. It's always a Cinderella room. Wow, look at this whole area here. Yeah, this is incredible. Well, look at the table. It's like a fit in. I love those. Oh yeah, look at this new table it's here. Not in the way. Yeah. Nice new balcony chairs and a nice new table. Still at port, as you can see. This is a smart feature. I love this room. I like this room too. And this is, look, the phone is tucked away in here. Oh yeah. Not sitting there taking up valuable real estate. But now whenever I want to call for room service, I got to come stand over here. Yes, but look what you have now next to your bed. Yes, but now next to the bed, we have USBs. Well, obviously it's a newer updated ship. So yeah, we have like USB cords, <laughs> USB ports. I mean, what? It was so dramatic. <laughs> Wait till you see it. Exactly. Whoa, looks so, <laughs> no, you have not. Looks so different in person. Exactly. This is luxury. Wow, this is so luxurious. Look how nice that is. Very nice. Wow. And you thought I was being dramatic. Well, yes, you still kind of were. <laughs> it was amazing. <laughs> Such a nice shower. <laughs> yeah, this it's is the same design, but it's nicer. Yeah, definitely, you know, more modern, more luxurious looking. More up to date. Yeah. Plenty of closet space. Robes. And then the TV is now here, and it's a much larger TV screen. On the previous ships, the TV would be over there, like by the desk area. But on this ship, it's a much larger screen, and it's right in front of the bed. So that's pretty awesome. Also, one of my favorite features that I've seen on other vlogs is, <laughs> is the refrigerator. It's kind of like, it's a drawer refrigerator. And you know, you would never think that the refrigerator would be in here. It is, so now we can put our bottles of wine in there. Did you see the fridge? No, I have not. Oh my God, look how steamy it got already. I know, it got really warm in here, so why? Yeah, because the balcony door was you open. You left it open on the The bottom. veranda. Oh. All right, so just order room service. I ordered a bucket of ice to put our, our bottle of Moet in there, two wine glasses, and then a little dessert, because I didn't have dessert for lunch. Ooh. That looks nice. That looks really good. Okay, let me have a bite really fast. Let's try it. It's okay. I'm definitely not gonna finish it, but no. it's fine. Is it rich? Not really. No. It's not the best, but it's okay. It's pretty. Tonight's dinner is at World of Marvel. So we're very excited because all the new things that we haven't tried. New shows, new dining restaurants. It hooks Barbary, oh, so you get- where they make you the old Yeah, fashion. you can get a shave and a haircut. Oh yeah, and it's yeah. like a whiskey bar. And they make you old fashioned. Oh, oh you want a shave? And a, <laughs> I think you need one. And, a, and an old fashioned. Really cool in there. Hooked okay. Barbie from 12.30 to 10 p.m. We just came into one of the cinemas just to, doing some exploring around the ship. And this is kind of like a home cinema. Like it's very small and cute and cozy, isn't it? Yeah, but it's Peter Pan. It's Peter Pan. So look. Where's it, Peter Pan? So we have Tinkerbell right here. There's Tink. And then... Oh, she's what, all over. She's oh, you're talking. Oh, you're talking about this right here. Right. Like Pete the Pan. Oh, look, it's even on the back of the chairs. These look really cozy. And do they bend backwards? They don't. Have a seat. Tell me how it's comfortable. It's a little... Is it, it feels like stiff. Uh, yeah, it's, I'm sort of like... They this. don't go back at no. all? Weird. You rest in the jacuzzi for 10 to 15 minutes. You also uh, do the massage of your choice. Any of the massages that oh, we nice. have. Okay. And then last but not least, this is the... Rainforest. Rainforest. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so it's much more bigger and more accommodating mm -hmm. than the other ships. We have restrooms here, we have tea and uh, water and fresh towels there. And then the famous room that actually, like I think you know about already, yeah. is that Frigidaria, which is an ice room. It's not freezing cold, but it is chilly, okay? Like, like a, a meat locker? Oh, okay. <laughs> Feels good though. Yeah, it feels nice. Yeah, no wonder why people like it after a hot day. Yeah. Yes, and then we have three rainforest showers with different splashes. And Laconium is a dry sauna. Still smell amazing. Laconium is a dry sauna. Oh, nice. It smells like what is it? Wow, nice. And then our famous heated lounges. Good for aches and pains in your back and also. 
Does it stay at this temperature or gets warmer? It, 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 t it stays that temperature, but I feel like when you feel it like this, uh -huh. it's not as warm as when you're sitting you, you down. Have your full oh, body. Oh, yeah, yes, I can see what yes. you mean. Yeah. And at this side, we have the hammam. Hammam is a wet steam room. Good for, uh, so when you're booking, when you're booking the, the area, it also comes up with the exfoliators, like the scrubs. So it's good to use them here because it's nice and steamy. And then we proceed to the outside area. This area is open from 8 until 10. How much is the day pass? So the day pass is $94 coming with the two scrubs, okay? Okay, with the scrubs. Yes. Okay. Oh, it rained, okay. Outside area, more of relaxation lounges and suites. Oh, nice. As well as like the jacuzzis. So it's nice and huge. And so cozy, very yeah. And it is raining. <laughs> for some reason, every time we come to Port Canaveral, it always rains here. Except for maybe like once. But hey, I guess that's Florida for you in the summer. So we're currently at the Bayou. Right now we're looking at the menu. He's saying that the popular drink is the Hurricane. So we decided to get the drink of the day, which is the Captain's Mai Tai, one of my favorite drinks here on Disney Cruise Line. Cheers. Mm, oh, that's good. $12.98 for two drinks. Not bad at all for two drinks of the day. We are sailing away. It is really horrible weather, unfortunately. What's up with this weather? It's weird. Like, I feel like I'm on a Disney cruise, but I also don't feel like I'm on a Disney cruise. It seems so, like, unfamiliar. <laughs> Yeah, it's different. Back in our stay room, we actually just went to the spa, census spa, to do a spa raffle to see if we won anything. This is my third time doing a spa raffle and I never win any, <laughs> never win anything. It's all right. We ended up deciding to get a rainforest pass for one day. It was a little expensive, more expensive than it is on the other ships. On the Disney Dream, it was $29 to be there the whole day. On this ship, because it's new, I feel like they can take advantage of you. They want to charge you $90, $90. It was a little pricey, but it is a newer ship. It is nicer amenities. And again, you have access to it pretty much 14 hours tomorrow. So we're going to use it tomorrow on our Nassau day. Uh, we're not going to get off the ship tomorrow. There's too much to do and too much to explore on this ship. I feel like nobody ever gets off at Nassau. Like if you're a first time cruiser, you get off at Nassau. But once you've been on a cruise so many times, like this is my 10th Disney cruise. I don't know if I said it yet, but this is my 10th. And it's his ninth Disney cruise. So after this cruise, I will be officially platinum on Disney cruise. But for now, we have dinner in like 15, 20 minutes at World of Marvel. So excited. I'm actually kind of hungry. So I am ready to eat. <gasps> Announcement. Well, a very pleasant good evening, Disney Wish. It's your cruise director, Jimmy, speaking, and certainly hope that you're settled in, having a wonderful time thus far. And well, as we move into the evening hours, there certainly are lots of fun events and activities taking place. Anyways, we'll talk later. Bye. Off dinner, we brought our own wine. Can you guys hear Mary Poppins singing over the over the speaker? A spoonful of medicine. A spoonful of sugar makes the medicine go down. <laughs> no more drinks for you. <laughs> <laughs> so we are currently on deck seven and World of Marvel is on deck four. All right, so just like for those who are familiar with the dream or the wish, the walls are a little different. Oh, here we are, World of Marvel. You guys hear the Marvel music? Avengers Assemble! This guy loves Marvel, so when I met him, he used to take me to all the Marvel movies. <laughs> He's the one who got me into Marvel. I get oh, into all the good this stuff. is so magical. <laughs> I love this. Oh, we got a table all to ourselves. Thank you very oh, much. Oh, awesome, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So we have our Avengers bread plate. Uh, luckily, we got seated in a table by ourselves because Disney Cruise Line does seat you with other people if you have a small party. But luckily for us, we didn't get seated with anybody today. So unlike the other ships, they're now giving uh, paper menus, like actual menus here. Oh, look, it's starting the show. <laughs> You know what, I need to breathe, find my chi. I just need 15 minutes to. Hi, I'm Scott Lang. Um, but you might know me as Ant-Man. And I am Hawk Van Dyne, the Wasp. Look, before we start, let me address the road. One, activate! Pretty sweet, right? Oh, oh. <laughs> oh. Whoa, what is, what is that? That is your talisman. Oh. 
Yeah, I see what you mean. That's, that's terrible. But why did that enlarge? Our first meal at one of the main dining room restaurants. So we got some shrimp, we got a bao bun, and then we also got a salmon dish. Salmon? Yeah, so that's like filled with like a cream cheese. Not crazy about it. It's good, it's just different. I will try the bao bun, dip it in all the sauces. What do you think? It's good. Try the shrimp, this is in front of you as well. That bao bun with a mouthful. Try the shrimp. But yeah, the bao bun was pretty good. You get shrimp? Mm. Yeah, that's it. My favorite. So our entrees are here. I got this pork schnitzel and what did you get again? Pork chop. Pork chop. Time for some tea oh, and then also time for a top secret dessert. Thank you. It's Ammon and the Wild. Hey. You are amazing. <laughs> you have to do something Thanks for saving us. Get an autograph. You should get an autograph. <laughs> OMG, look at the dessert. It's a Pim Sunday. It's huge, and we both ordered one, and we also ordered another dessert. Here they are. Oh, nice. Thank you. Right over here. Wow. So good. Thank you so much. Oh, John, what'd you get? Uh, the torta. The torta. I thought you said it was Gateau de l'Opera. It looks like it. From the other cruise? Wow, the best part about this whole dinner was the dessert, I think. I mean, I enjoyed this the most. I just wanted to taste everything else. All right, so how was it? It's delicious. So good. Y'all, we're doing some shopping right now. Oh, that's something sure you want? Tons of smalls, and then it goes to extra large. Really? Yeah, they're sold out. Interesting. Oh, this looks like a medium so right here. So one thing I actually like, and it's gone. Really? Yeah. Maybe they have some in the back. John. Hey there, buddy. It's like a party here in the atrium. So John bought me a gift at the shop. Thank you for my gifts. You're welcome. Hey, there's a coffee shop right there. You want a coffee? No, but it smells really good. Yeah, it does smell really good. We are back in the room. We're getting some glasses of wine to take with us to the show. Tonight's show is Seize the Adventure. And we're very excited because it's, they're all new shows that we've never seen before. Like, obviously we've been on the dream so many times. This time it's like new shows, new restaurants, new everything. So we're very excited about that. Okay, two glasses of wine. Let's go to the show. Cheers. All right, tonight's show is going to be at the Walt Disney Theater. It's Seize the Adventure. Let's see if we can find a good seat up front so I can see. Oh, I forgot my glasses. One of the beauties of this new theater is that your wine glass actually fits in the cup holder. <gasps> How amazing is that? Yeah, it doesn't do that on the dream. It doesn't do it on any of the other ships. One point for the Disney Wish. So we got a good seat, kind of, right here to the side. Not too bad. So cool to see like a whole new show. Something other than what we're used to. Alright, Mr. John just went to the bathroom. Look at this. This is the Untangled Salon. Look at that. Isn't this cool? Yeah, you can get mani patties. I want to get my nails colored. Do you? Yeah. You should do it. I want to get like little sparkles, little pixie dust. But it's cool in there. Look at that. Right now we're going to go check out the adults area. John is taking the elevator and I'm going to take the stairs. Let's see who gets there first. I'm sure he will. Also, the Disney Wish has a bunch of new art. So this is Encanto art from the movie Encanto. Okay, I am lost. I have no idea where I'm going. Um, okay, I think it's up this way. Let's see if we find him. Oh, there you are. I was like... I got lost. I told you you had to get through the elevator. I got lost. <laughs> Look at the aqua mouse. So cool. We gotta try to get on it one of these days. There you go, Adults Cove, Cove Cafe and Bar is in the adults area, which is back that way. So right here, there's a, jac there's a jacuzzi right there. So I'm guessing this is like the entrance to like the adults area. 
So you have all these lounge chairs right here. Hopefully it's sunny tomorrow, yeah? I hope so, yeah. Those bottles of Moet are not gonna drink themselves. Hopefully the sun comes out tomorrow and we can lay out and drink our bottles of a bubbly, and relax here by the pool deck. I know it's kind of dark, sorry guys. Yeah, it's definitely got a different feel near the old section. Yeah, this whole ship has a different feel. Like I feel like I'm on a Disney cruise, but then at the same time it's like, it's unfamiliar. If that makes any sense. Okay, here, is here we are. The adult area. Hard to see at night, but we'll show it to you during the day. So we have these pools. We have these little pools. Oh, that's the infinity pool. There's an infinity pool right in there. Infinity lounge. Infinity pool right here. But again, I'll show it to you guys better in the daylight. All right. We are back. I'm exhausted, everybody. Our first night, two chocolates and a little elephant. I am pooped. And the wine did not help. Probably about to go to bed. It's about to be 10 o'clock p.m. I like to go to bed early because I want to get an early wake up tomorrow so I can go to the gym, go claim my seat at the adults pool area because there's a lot of adults here. Before we go to bed, we need to go fill up our water bottles with agua. We need some H2O in these. I forgot that we drove here this morning. Yeah. Three hours, oh my gosh. Yeah. Tomorrow's dinner is at Arendelle Frozen Restaurant. Definitely cannot wait for that. I'm gonna end Embarkation Day vlog right now. Thanks so much for watching. If you're new to my channel, thanks so much for joining me. Please be sure to subscribe. Follow me on Instagram where I post a lot of other things. Leave me some comments down below. Let me know what you think about The Wish. We're gonna do a whole video after this, uh, kind of talking about our experience on The Wish, what we think about it. And I know that there's a lot of opinions out there on the Disney wish and obviously we have our opinions as well but we'll talk about that on another video thanks for watching we will see you guys on the next video bye